So thank you for joining us today and welcome. Uh, my name is Peter Wiseman. I'm working within the uh, product line at Seeker Tools. Uh, joining me today in this session, I've got Alexei Avrianov. Alexei, you're responsible for grooving and parting off systems here at uh, Seeker Tools. Thanks for being here. Thanks, Peter. And I understand you would like to share some news about the JetEye grooving and parting off system. Uh, yes, correct. Uh, this is about the evolvement of Jetstream tooling uh, into JetEye, which has already begun and is ongoing on uh, some other product families. And now it's time for grooving and parting off specifically for MDT products. Okay, so we've already uh, started to incorporate this product uh, and obviously it's, it's proving successful. Can you tell us about your customer then? What is it that you think we need to make an improvement on with this system? Uh, well, uh, grooving and parting off operations as, as such are quite complicated. From the customer perspective, there is a quite a number of common challenges uh, when it comes to this area. Poor machining performance with short tool life and low part quality are just some of those. Uh, then you should add quite unstable process with a lot of machine downtime. On top of that, customers may experience some troubles when it comes to manipulations with tools, like for example, difficult to change it, connect coolant, etc. This is something that they want to avoid and we want to help them with that. Okay, so what is it about grooving and parting off that really makes it so challenging? Uh, well, they are quite demanding operations, uh, so to say. Uh, such tools are supposed to work in rather harsh environments. You can imagine a relatively small tiny insert which with long overhang is supposed to penetrate deep inside of the workpiece material, uh, where you can have uh, high temperature uh, instability and so on. Uh, on one side, uh, coolant could be a solution, but it's often not so easy for it to reach the cutting zone in such deep cuts. Uh, things get worse uh, with tough materials like, for example, stainless steel. Its low thermal conductivity results in even higher temperatures. Okay, and how are chips typically behaving in this situation? I guess it's quite challenging. Uh, well, sure, uh, chip control is another point of importance here. Uh, with long and difficult to remove chips, new issues appear. At the same time, multiplying existing ones. It's one more barrier for coolant to get through when trying to reach the cutting zone. Uh, they cause stretches, scratches on the surface, they affect the tool life and increase machine and downtime. You really need to get rid of chips. Okay, so we haven't really touched yet on the handling of the tool. Is there anything that you can say about that? Uh, well, in general, the demand on trouble-free, user-friendly solutions is growing at a very fast pace. No one wants to spend a lot of time when it comes to tool change and struggle with extra components which cause interference during machining. Okay, and I guess customers typically are looking to stabilize their process, reduce stoppages, mm. and get the most, get the best out of the machine. So let's move on and talk about the solution that we're offering here. Uh, well, uh, in short, uh, JetEye is the key for such uh, cases. It's a solution which is integrated, precise coolant delivery that can address most of the earlier mentioned challenges. Uh, improved performance, stable process, reduced waste of time, and it's a simple to use tool. Okay, so that's great. Thanks very much for joining us here, Alexei, today. My pleasure. And to find out more about the JetEye system and how it delivers coolant effectively to the cutting zone, then uh, click on the link that comes directly with this video, uh, or alternatively, contact your local Seco representative to find out more information. So from us today, we just say thank you, join us soon.